What are the seven hills of Rome? The city of Rome sits upon seven hills, Capitoline. Quirinal, Viminal, Esquiline, Sialian, Aventine, and Palatine. According to ancient legend, the first settlement in the area. The city of Romulus, was built upon Palatine. What are the seven hills of Rome? The city of Rome sits upon seven hills, Capitoline. Quirinal, Viminal, Esquiline, Sialian, Aventine, and Palatine. According to ancient legend, the first settlement in the area. The city of Romulus, was built upon Palatine. Where is the Jutland Peninsula? The Jutland Peninsula extends north from Germany and is home to the country of Denmark. Where is the Jutland Peninsula? The Jutland Peninsula extends north from Germany and is home to the country of Denmark. Where is the Black Forest? Located in southwestern Germany, the Black Forest is a densely forested, mountainous region that is a popular location for vacationing, with its many health resorts and wilderness trails. The Black Forest is the source of the Danube River and is renowned for its cuckoo clocks. Where is the Black Forest? Located in southwestern Germany, the Black Forest is a densely forested, mountainous region that is a popular location for vacationing, with its many health resorts and wilderness trails. The Black Forest is the source of the Danube River and is renowned for its cuckoo clocks. What is a Reich? The word Reich literally means empire in German. The First Reich is considered to be the Holy Roman Empire from 800 to 1806 CE. The Second Reich was Germany. United under Otto von Bismarck, from 1871 to 1918. In 1933, Adolf Hitler established the Third Reich. The Nazi regime, which lasted until the defeat of Germany at the end of World War II, in 1945. What is a Reich? The word Reich literally means empire in German. 
The First Reich is considered to be the Holy Roman Empire from 800 to 1806 CE. The Second Reich was Germany. United under Otto von Bismarck, from 1871 to 1918. In 1933, Adolf Hitler established the Third Reich. The Nazi regime, which lasted until the defeat of Germany at the end of World War II, in 1945. What was the Potsdam Conference? At the end of World War II, the United States, United Kingdom, and U. SSR met at Potsdam, Germany, from July 17 to August 2, 1945. For a conference to determine how to control Germany and other eastern territories. The Potsdam Conference divided Germany and Austria into Soviet. French, American, and British zones of control. What was the Potsdam Conference? At the end of World War II, the United States, United Kingdom, and U. SSR met at Potsdam, Germany, from July 17 to August 2, 1945. For a conference to determine how to control Germany and other eastern territories. The Potsdam Conference divided Germany and Austria into Soviet, French, American, and British zones of control. Who designed and planned the capital of Brazil? Brasilia was created in 1956 by two people, urban planner Lucio Costa and architect Oscar Niemeyer. What is a Reich? The word Reich literally means empire in German. The First Reich is considered to be the Holy Roman Empire from 800 to 1806 CE. The Second Reich was Germany. United under Otto von Bismarck from 1871 to 1918. In 1933, Adolf Hitler established the Third Reich. The Nazi regime, which lasted until the defeat of Germany at the end of World War II, in 1945. What South American city has more Japanese residents than any city outside of Japan? Sao Paulo, Brazil, has more Japanese residents than any other city outside of Japan. Well over 2 million Japanese live in this urban area. The original settlers 791 farmers traveled to Brazil from Kobe, Japan, in 1908. Where are the Leeward Islands?
The Leeward Islands are also located in the Caribbean and are less exposed to the northeasterlies. Because these islands are lee, or away from the wind, they were named the Leeward Islands. The Leeward Islands include Dominica, Guadeloupe, Montserrat, Antigua, Barbuda, St. Kitts, Nevis, Anguilla, and the Virgin Islands. Where is the oldest church in the Americas? The oldest church, the Cathedral Basilica Menor de Santa, was built by Columbus San Diego. The first stone was set in 1514 in Santo Domingo, the Dominican Republic. What makes Brazilian automobiles run? Over half of Brazilian automobiles use alternatives to petroleum known as gasohol and ethanol. Gasohol is made from sugarcane and ethanol is made from alcohol. The two fuels are much less expensive than petroleum-based gasoline. What port does landlocked Bolivia use? Having no access to the sea itself, Bolivia made an agreement in 1992 with Peru to use its port at Ilo. How many people visit the Caribbean each year? Approximately 35 million people visit the Caribbean's beautiful countries and islands. How many volcanoes are in Europe? There are more than 100 volcanoes in Europe. What is Iceland's leading export? Over three quarters of Iceland's exports are fish. The fish industry employs 12% of the nation's workforce. And the country is economically vulnerable to fluctuations in world fish prices. What was the first independent country in the Caribbean? Haiti was the first independent country in the Caribbean. In 1791, the slaves in Haiti revolted, which led to Haiti's independence from France in 1804. Though. Haiti once occupied the entire island of Hispaniola, Haiti now shares the island with the Dominican Republic. What statue overlooks Rio de Janeiro? The 100 foot high, 30.5 meter high, statue of Christ the Redeemer stands. 
arms outstretched, over the city of Rio de Janeiro. The statue of Jesus Christ, with its base on top of Corcovado Mountain at 2,340 feet. 713 meters, was built in commemoration of the 100th anniversary of Brazilian independence. What was the Potsdam Conference? At the end of World War II, the United States, United Kingdom, and U. SSR met at Potsdam, Germany, from July 17 to August 2, 1945. For a conference to determine how to control Germany and other eastern territories. The Potsdam Conference divided Germany and Austria into Soviet. French, American, and British zones of control. How did Cuba become a communist country? Having been an independent country for 57 years, the Cuban government, run by the dictator Fulgencio Batista y Salvador. Fell to the communist leader Fidel Castro in 1959. Because of Cuba's communist government. The United States severed its relationship with Cuba, forcing the island to ally itself with the Soviet Union. In October 1962, the presence of this nearby communist country caused extreme terror. In the United States when the USSR attempted to place nuclear missiles within Cuba. The Cuban Missile Crisis is thought to be the closest the Cold War ever got to a real nuclear war. Where is the Bay of Pigs? The Bay of Pigs is a bay in southwestern Cuba. In 1961, the bay became the location of an attempted coup against the Cuban. Government by revolutionaries trained and financed by the U.S. Central Intelligence. Agency. After the attempted coup failed, the United States abandoned the revolutionaries. Most of whom were killed or captured in the days following the coup attempt. Where is the Western Hemisphere's oldest university? Founded in 1538, the Autonomous University of Santo Domingo in the Dominican Republic is the oldest university in the Western Hemisphere. What is the world's second longest barrier reef? The second longest barrier reef in the world lies just off the Atlantic coast of Belize. On the northeastern corner of Central America, and consists of Lighthouse Reef and Glover's Reef. Belize's reefs are only a few dozen miles long while the Great Barrier. The longest reef in the world, is hundreds.
Was Cuba ever a part of the United States? The United States went to war against Spain in 1898 to assist Cubans who were rebelling against Spanish rule. The United States took control of Cuba during the Spanish-American War in 1898 and held it until 1902. When Cuba was granted independence. The three-year military occupation by the United States ended with an agreement that the United States would be allowed to lease Guantanamo Bay, which the United States still uses as a naval base. Where is the southernmost glacier in Europe? The southernmost European glacier is also high atop the Apennines, near Corno Grande. Due to global warming it has lost a significant amount of its mass. Where is the Black Forest? Located in southwestern Germany, the Black Forest is a densely forested mountainous region that is a popular location for vacationing, with its many health resorts and wilderness trails. The Black Forest is the source of the Danube River and is renowned for its cuckoo clocks. Where are the East and West Indies? The East and West Indies are separated by half the planet. The West Indies are islands in the Caribbean, including the Greater Antilles, the Lesser Antilles, and the Bahamas, while the East Indies include islands that encompass Indonesia, Malaysia, and Brunei. When Christopher Columbus reached the New World in 1492, he believed that he had actually found a shorter route to the East Indies. Thus, Columbus thought the islands he had reached made up a portion of the Indies and considered the island's inhabitants to be Indians. What are the seven hills of Rome? The city of Rome sits upon seven hills, Capitoline, Quirinal, Viminal, Esquiline, Sialian, Aventine, and Palatine. According to ancient legend, the first settlement in the area, the city of Romulus, was built upon Palatine. What is the actual name of Bogota? Bogota, Colombia, was originally called Santa Fe. More recently, the name became Santa Fe de Bogota. Today, the Colombian capital is known as Bogota for short and about 8 million people live in its metropolitan area. How much oil is produced by Europe?
Europe produces 6,358,000 barrels of oil per day. Which is approximately 7.9% of the world's total production of 80,247,000 barrels per day. What are the capitals of Bolivia? Bolivia has two capitals La Paz is the administrative capital. While Sucre is the constitutional and judicial capital. Several countries divide national functions between cities. Which volcano opposes the most risk to people in Europe? MT. Vesuvius, on the western coast of Italy, lies very near a city of more than one million people, Naples. The volcano is still active, and geologists predict there is a very good chance it will erupt again in the future. Potentially wiping out Naples and the surrounding area. Do things really disappear in the Bermuda Triangle? The Bermuda Triangle, or Devil's Triangle, is a popular legend that suggests a supernatural or paranormal reason for a supposedly large number of missing aircraft and seagoing vessels within its area. The legend generally places the area of the Bermuda Triangle in the Atlantic Ocean. With its three corners located at Bermuda, Puerto Rico, and Miami, Florida. But you won't be able to find the Bermuda Triangle on a map since it is not a geographically or politically defined area. And its location is solely designated by the legend. Though the legend has circulated for at least a century. There seems to be little evidence that this area is subjected to anything but natural hazards and human error. Most of the evidence for the phenomena in the Bermuda Triangle stems from the disappearance of the five aircraft of Flight 19 in December 1945, as well as a search plane that was sent to find them. Though the popular version of the disappearance of Flight 19 assumes a mysterious end. A mixture of missing navigational apparatus, human error, low fuel, and choppy seas most likely led to the squadron's disappearance and demise. How many volcanoes does Iceland have? Iceland, formed by volcanoes along the Mid-Atlantic Ridge, is home to more than 100 volcanoes. Of these, more than 20 have erupted over the past few centuries. Where are the Windward Islands? The Windward Islands are located in the Caribbean and are exposed to the northeast trade winds. Northeasterlies, of the Atlantic Ocean. Because of their vulnerability to these winds, the islands were named the Windward Islands. 
The Windward Islands include Martinique, St. Lucia, St. Vincent, the Grenadines, and Grenada. Where is the Jutland Peninsula? The Jutland Peninsula extends north from Germany and is home to the country of Denmark. Where has one third of the population of Suriname emigrated to since 1975? Suriname was a Dutch colony until it gained independence in 1975. Since 1975, approximately 200. 000 of its residents have emigrated to the Netherlands. Who is Alberto Fujimori and what has he done for Peru? Alberto Fujimori, who was president of Peru from 1990 to 2000, was credited with ending terrorism in Peru and turning around a devastated economy. Some believe, however, that he trampled on the rights of individuals and indigenous people during his oftentimes authoritarian rule. He later was convicted on charges of abuse of power in ordering the illegal search of the apartment of his security chief's spouse. He was sentenced to six years in prison. What country is crossed by both the equator and a tropic? Brazil is the only country crossed by the equator at 0 degrees and the Tropic of Capricorn 23.5 degrees south. What is Mardi Gras? The Catholic festival Mardi Gras literally means Fat Tuesday in French. Parades, dancing, and carnivals are all part of this pre-Ash Wednesday celebration. Known as Carnival, it is very popular in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil, and New Orleans, Louisiana. The Brazilian festival is a significant source of tourism-related income for the country. What is the world's highest capital city? La Paz, Bolivia, is the world's highest capital city. La Paz is located high in the Andes Mountains at an elevation of 12,507 feet, 3,700 meters. It was founded in 1548 by Spanish explorers and is now home to approximately 711,000 people. Who is the biggest producer of oil in Europe? Norway wins as Europe's biggest oil producer, producing approximately 3.2 million barrels per day.
the United Kingdom and Denmark are the second and third biggest oil producers in Europe. What was the Berlin Wall? At the end of World War II, Germany was divided into four zones. Each occupied separately by the United States, the United Kingdom, France, and the U. SSR. The city of Berlin, while located entirely within the Soviet-occupied zone, was itself divided into four zones. Soon thereafter, the Soviets stopped cooperating with the other Allied powers. The three zones occupied by the United States, United Kingdom, and France joined together to create West Germany, while the Soviet zone became East Germany. A similar split occurred in the city of Berlin. The city of Berlin held the dichotomy of East versus West, Communist versus Capitalist. Many people who lived in East Berlin could see that those in West Berlin generally had a higher standard of living. It is estimated that over 2 million East Germans fled to the West within Berlin. In August 1961, the Communist government, determined to stop this mass exodus began to build the Berlin Wall, a wall that physically divided East and West Berlin. On the West side, the wall became the location of spray-painted messages that voiced free opinions. On the East side of the wall lay a deserted area of barbed wire and armed guards called No Man's Land. For decades, the Berlin Wall stood as the physical version of the psychological Iron Curtain that separated East from West. On November 8, 1989, the Berlin Wall came tumbling down. And soon thereafter the era of the Cold War also ended. What was the Berlin Wall? At the end of World War II, Germany was divided into four zones. Each occupied separately by the United States, the United Kingdom, France, and the U. SSR. The city of Berlin, while located entirely within the Soviet-occupied zone, was itself divided into four zones. Soon thereafter, the Soviets stopped cooperating with the other Allied powers. The three zones occupied by the United States, United Kingdom, and France joined together to create West Germany, while the Soviet zone became East Germany. A similar split occurred in the city of Berlin. The city of Berlin held the dichotomy of East versus West, Communist versus Capitalist. Many people who lived in East Berlin could see that those in West Berlin generally had a higher standard of living. It is estimated that over 2 million East Germans fled to the West within Berlin. In August 1961, the Communist government, determined to stop this mass exodus, began to build the Berlin Wall, a wall that physically divided East and West Berlin. On the West side, the wall became the location of spray-painted messages that voiced free opinions. On the east side of the wall lay a deserted area of barbed wire and armed guards called No Man's Land. For decades, 
the Berlin Wall stood as the physical version of the psychological iron curtain that separated East from West. On November 8, 1989, the Berlin Wall came tumbling down. And soon thereafter the era of the Cold War also ended. Where was Checkpoint Charlie? Checkpoint Charlie was a famous crossing point on the Berlin Wall between East and West Berlin. Used mainly by tourists and you. As military personnel. Where was Checkpoint Charlie? Checkpoint Charlie was a famous crossing point on the Berlin Wall between East and West Berlin. Used mainly by tourists and you. As military personnel. What is Hadrian's Wall? Hadrian's Wall was built under the direction of the Roman Emperor Hadrian in 122 c. He located in northern Great Britain, it was intended to keep out the Caledonians of Scotland. Built of mud and stone, the wall stretched nearly 75 miles, 120 kilometers. From Solway Firth in the west to the Tyne River in the east, near Newcastle. What is Hadrian's Wall? Hadrian's Wall was built under the direction of the Roman Emperor Hadrian in 122 c. He located in northern Great Britain, it was intended to keep out the Caledonians of Scotland. Built of mud and stone, the wall stretched nearly 75 miles, 120 kilometers. From Solway Firth in the west to the Tyne River in the east, near Newcastle. What was the Maginot Line? The Maginot Line was a defensive zone that was built in the 1930s. To defend France against the possibility of a German invasion. The zone consisted of underground tunnels, artillery, anti-tank obstacles and many other defensive structures and stratagems to slow down invading Germans. The Maginot Line stretched for approximately 200 miles, 322 kilometers, near the French-German border. During World War II, when the Germans did invade France, the Germans bypassed the Maginot Line by storming through neutral Belgium. Thus, the Maginot Line had failed its one great test because it was too short. The line was also rendered obsolete by the fact that it did not provide defense against the new modern warfare that included aircraft. What was the Maginot Line?
The Maginot Line was a defensive zone that was built in the 1930s. To defend France against the possibility of a German invasion. The zone consisted of underground tunnels, artillery, anti-tank obstacles. And many other defensive structures and stratagems to slow down invading Germans. The Maginot Line stretched for approximately 200 miles, 322 kilometers, near the French-German border. During World War II, when the Germans did invade France. The Germans bypassed the Maginot Line by storming through neutral Belgium. Thus, the Maginot Line had failed its one great test because it was too short. The line was also rendered obsolete by the fact that it did not provide defense against the new modern warfare that included aircraft. What is Benelux? Benelux stands for Belgium, the Netherlands, and Luxembourg. And represents an economic alliance between the three, that was formed in the 1940s. At the time Belgium was primarily industrial and the Netherlands was primarily agricultural. The two countries' economies complemented each other, a relationship strengthened by an economic union. Luxembourg, which has a varied economy and is extremely small, has long been closely affiliated with its two larger neighbors, and thus also benefited from the union. Today, the countries are referred to as Benelux whenever. Referred to in terms of market analyses, commerce, and trade. What is Benelux? Benelux stands for Belgium, the Netherlands, and Luxembourg. And represents an economic alliance between the three, that was formed in the 1940s. At the time Belgium was primarily industrial and the Netherlands was primarily agricultural. The two countries' economies complemented each other, a relationship strengthened by an economic union. Luxembourg, which has a varied economy and is extremely small, has long been closely affiliated with its two larger neighbors, and thus also benefited from the union. Today, the countries are referred to as Benelux whenever. Referred to in terms of market analyses, commerce, and trade. How many Irish left during the Great Starvation? In the mid-19th century, Ireland suffered from the Great Starvation. From 1845 to 1850, a fungus ravaged the potato crops of Ireland. Destroying the primary food source of Irish peasants. Though many have called this tragic event the Great Potato Famine. The mass starvation of the Irish people was caused more by the lack of assistance from the British government than by the famine itself. It is estimated that over one million people died during these catastrophic times. And approximately twice that number left their homeland in an effort to find food and solace.
How many Irish left during the Great Starvation? In the mid-19th century, Ireland suffered from the Great Starvation. From 1845 to 1850, a fungus ravaged the potato crops of Ireland. Destroying the primary food source of Irish peasants. Though many have called this tragic event the Great Potato Famine. The mass starvation of the Irish people was caused more by the lack of assistance from the British government than by the famine itself. It is estimated that over one million people died during these catastrophic times. And approximately twice that number left their homeland in an effort to find food and solace. Who was at sea the Iceman? In 1991, two German tourists were hiking in the Itzal Alps, on the Italian side of the border between Italy and Austria. When they happened upon what appeared to be a corpse buried beneath the ice. Astounded, they alerted authorities. It was found that Itzi, as the body was named, was a 45-year-old traveler himself who was more than 5,300 years old. It was likely he faced what investigators believe was a violent death. On his body were more than 50 tattoos, jewelry, and weapons. All of which gave researchers clues into the lives of our Copper Age ancestors. Who was at sea the Iceman? In 1991, two German tourists were hiking in the Itzal Alps on the Italian side of the border between Italy and Austria. When they happened upon what appeared to be a corpse buried beneath the ice. Astounded, they alerted authorities. It was found that Itzi, as the body was named, was a 45-year-old traveler himself who was more than 5,300 years old. It was likely he faced what investigators believe was a violent death. On his body were more than 50 tattoos, jewelry, and weapons. All of which gave researchers clues into the lives of our Copper Age ancestors. What is the European Union? In 1951, six Western European countries joined together in the European Coal and Steel Community. As more members joined, the organization grew in scope and soon became an organization that helped mend and meld the economies of Europe. In 1993, the European Community was renamed the European Union EU. Today, there are 27 member states, Austria, Belgium, Bulgaria, Cyprus, Czech Republic, Denmark, Estonia, Finland, France, Germany, Greece, Hungary, Ireland, Italy, Latvia, Lithuania, Luxembourg, Malta, the Netherlands, Poland, Portugal, Romania, Slovakia, Slovenia, Spain, Sweden, and the United Kingdom.
the European Union has a flag, an anthem, and in 1999 began using a single monetary unit, the euro. What is the European Union? In 1951, six Western European countries joined together in the European Coal and Steel Community. As more members joined, the organization grew in scope and soon became an organization that helped mend and meld the economies of Europe. In 1993, the European Community was renamed the European Union EU. Today, there are 27 member states, Austria, Belgium, Bulgaria, Cyprus, Czech Republic, Denmark, Estonia, Finland, France, Germany, Greece, Hungary, Ireland, Italy, Latvia, Lithuania, Luxembourg, Malta, the Netherlands, Poland, Portugal, Romania, Slovakia, Slovenia, Spain, Sweden, and the United Kingdom. The European Union has a flag, an anthem, and in 1999 began using a single monetary unit, the euro. Where are the low countries? Belgium, the Netherlands, and Luxembourg are known as the Low Countries because of their low elevation. Where are the Low Countries? Belgium, the Netherlands, and Luxembourg are known as the Low Countries because of their low elevation. How do the Netherlands keep getting bigger? For hundreds of years, the Dutch have been expanding the size of their country by building dikes and draining, and reclaiming, land. These lands, known as polders, have greatly expanded the size of the Netherlands and are now considered one of the seven wonders of the modern world. How do the Netherlands keep getting bigger? For hundreds of years, the Dutch have been expanding the size of their country by building dikes and draining, and reclaiming, land. These lands, known as polders, have greatly expanded the size of the Netherlands and are now considered one of the seven wonders of the modern world. What is Randstad? The Randstad is a region of the Netherlands that includes the metropolitan areas of Amsterdam, The Hague, Rotterdam, and Utrecht. The urban area of the Randstad holds nearly half the Netherlands population. What is Randstad?
The Randstad is a region of the Netherlands that includes the metropolitan areas of Amsterdam, The Hague, Rotterdam, and Utrecht. The urban area of the Randstad holds nearly half the Netherlands population. What is the Hague? The Hague is a city on the west coast of the Netherlands with an approximate population of 450,000. The Hague is the home of many international organizations, such as the International Court of Justice. What is the Hague? The Hague is a city on the west coast of the Netherlands with an approximate population of 450,000. The Hague is the home of many international organizations, such as the International Court of Justice. How long is Chile? Chile stretches approximately 2,700 miles 4,344 kilometers, along the western coast of South America. At its widest it is only 100 miles 161 kilometers, across. Chile is a classic example of an elongated country, which makes governing difficult. Who was at sea the Iceman? In 1991, two German tourists were hiking in the Itzal Alps, on the Italian side of the border between Italy and Austria. When they happened upon what appeared to be a corpse buried beneath the ice. Astounded, they alerted authorities. It was found that Itzi, as the body was named, was a 45-year-old traveler himself who was more than 5,300 years old. It was likely he faced what investigators believe was a violent death. On his body were more than 50 tattoos, jewelry, and weapons all of which gave researchers clues into the lives of our Copper Age ancestors. Which river carries more water than any other in the world? Though the Amazon River is the second longest in the world, 4,000 miles over 6,400 kilometers. It carries more water to the ocean than does any other river in the world. Where is the Rock of Gibraltar? The Rock of Gibraltar is a limestone mountain located on the Gibraltar Peninsula in southern Spain. The city of Gibraltar, located on this same peninsula, is actually a British colony, and is used as a naval air base. This is the perfect location from which to control the Strait of Gibraltar.
the small waterway that connects the Mediterranean Sea with the Atlantic Ocean. Spain has continually advocated a claim for this area but has been consistently unable to retrieve this vital piece of land. On the opposite side of the Strait of Gibraltar, at the northern tip of Morocco, Spain has its own autonomous community, consisting of Ceuta and Melilla, which is also strategically located to control the Strait of Gibraltar. Is the Strait of Magellan crooked? Yes, it is. The Strait of Magellan is a winding waterway between South America and the islands of Tierra del Fuego at the southern tip of South America. This strait was discovered by the explorer Ferdinand Magellan in 1520 and has been used as a shortcut to avoid having to sail around Cape Horn, the southern tip of South America. What is Benelux? Benelux stands for Belgium, the Netherlands, and Luxembourg and represents an economic alliance between the three, that was formed in the 1940s. At the time Belgium was primarily industrial and the Netherlands was primarily agricultural. The two countries' economies complemented each other, a relationship strengthened by an economic union. Luxembourg, which has a varied economy and is extremely small has long been closely affiliated with its two larger neighbors, and thus also benefited from the Union. Today, the countries are referred to as Benelux whenever. Referred to in terms of market analyses, commerce, and trade. What was the Maginot Line? The Maginot Line was a defensive zone that was built in the 1930s to defend France against the possibility of a German invasion. The zone consisted of underground tunnels, artillery, anti-tank obstacles, and many other defensive structures and stratagems to slow down invading Germans. The Maginot Line stretched for approximately 200 miles, 322 kilometers, near the French-German border. During World War II, when the Germans did invade France, the Germans bypassed the Maginot Line by storming through neutral Belgium. Thus, the Maginot Line had failed its one great test because it was too short. The line was also rendered obsolete by the fact that it did not provide defense against the new modern warfare that included aircraft. Who owns Easter Island? Easter Island, which is located 2,237 miles west of Chile, is owned by Chile. On this island, there are over 100 large rocks carved into the shape of heads, complete with facial features. 
these large heads vary in size from 10 to 40 feet. 3 to 12 meters, and were made out of a soft, volcanic rock. How wide is the Strait of Gibraltar? The strait, which connects the Mediterranean Sea to the Atlantic Ocean between Africa and Spain, is 8 miles, 13 kilometers, wide at its narrowest. Which is farther east, Santiago, Chile, or Miami, Florida? Even though it lies on the west coast of South America, Santiago, Chile, is actually farther east than Miami, Florida. Though it is common to envision South America as directly south of North America, South America actually lies southeast of North America. What are the four climatic regions of the Andes? The Andes are known for their four defined climatic zones, which are based on elevation. The lowest zone, Tierra Caliente, hotlands, is ascribed to the area from the plains to 2,500 feet. 762 meters, and is where most of the population resides. The second zone is Tierra Templada, temperate land, which is from 2,500 to 6,000 feet, 762 to 1,829 meters. The third zone is Tierra Fria, cold land which is from 6,000 to 12,000 feet, 1,829 to 3,658 meters. Above 12,000 feet, 3,658 meters, is the fourth zone, Tierra Helada, frozen land. Where was Checkpoint Charlie? Checkpoint Charlie was a famous crossing point on the Berlin Wall between East and West Berlin. Used mainly by tourists and you. As military personnel. What is Randstad? The Randstad is a region of the Netherlands that includes the metropolitan areas of Amsterdam, The Hague, Rotterdam, and Utrecht. The urban area of the Randstad holds nearly half the Netherlands' population. What are the Apennines? The Apennines are a mountain range extending from northern to southern Italy for approximately 600 miles, 1,000 kilometers. The highest point is a place called Corno Grande, which reaches a summit at 9,500 feet, 2,912 meters.
How do the Netherlands keep getting bigger? For hundreds of years, the Dutch have been expanding the size of their country by building dikes and draining, and reclaiming, land. These lands, known as polders, have greatly expanded the size of the Netherlands and are now considered one of the seven wonders of the modern world. What are the Andes? The Andes are a mountain chain that runs along the entire west coast of South America, from Panama. At the southern tip of Central America, to the Strait of Magellan, at the southern tip of South America. This chain is about 4,500 miles, 7,240 kilometers. Long and contains high plateaus and one of the driest deserts on the planet, the Atacampa. The tallest mountain in South America, Aconcagua, 22,834 feet 6,960 meters. Is located in the southern Andes, on the border between Chile and Argentina. The ancient Inca city of Machu Picchu is located in the Andes of Peru. What is the world's southernmost city? Ushuaia, in southern Argentina, is the world's southernmost city. Ushuaia sits on Tierra del Fuego Island, south of the Strait of Magellan. Where is the world's tallest waterfall? Angel Falls, in Venezuela, is the world's tallest waterfall at 3,212 feet, 979 meters. American pilot Jimmy Angel discovered the waterfall and named it after himself in 1935. At the time of the discovery, the falls were known to indigenous peoples such as the Pemon for thousands of years. They called the falls Kirpakupe Meru, which means waterfall of the deepest place. What is the Pan American Highway? Begun in the 1930s, the Pan American Highway is the result of an international effort to create a highway stretching from Fairbanks, Alaska, to Buenos Aires, Argentina. In 1962 a bridge, known as the Bridge of the Americas, was built over the Panama Canal to continue the highway over the canal. A 100-mile 161-kilometer stretch of the highway in eastern Panama still remains unfinished. What is the primary religion throughout Latin America? Due to Spanish and Portuguese colonization, most Latin Americans are Catholic, about 
Protestants make up about 7% of the region. And the rest are atheists, non-religious, animists, or other religions. What is a cartel? A cartel is an organization made up of businesses that band together to eliminate competition, collude to fix prices, and control supply and production of a product or service. In South America, the word refers to the drug cartels of Colombia. Most notably the Medellin and Cali cartels, both which were crushed by the Colombian government. Later, government members and lieutenants of former cartel operatives stepped in and created their own cartels. Today, they are still manufacturing and distributing cocaine and its derivatives into the United States, which is the biggest consumer of cocaine in the world. What is the European Union? In 1951, six Western European countries joined together in the European Coal and Steel Community. As more members joined, the organization grew in scope and soon became an organization that helped mend and meld the economies of Europe. In 1993, the European community was renamed the European Union EU. Today, there are 27 member states, Austria, Belgium, Bulgaria, Cyprus, Czech Republic, Denmark, Estonia, Finland, France, Germany, Greece, Hungary, Ireland, Italy, Latvia, Lithuania, Luxembourg, Malta, the Netherlands, Poland, Portugal, Romania, Slovakia, Slovenia, Spain, Sweden, and the United Kingdom. The European Union has a flag, an anthem, and in 1999 began using a single monetary unit, the euro. Where are the low countries? Belgium, the Netherlands, and Luxembourg are known as the low countries because of their low elevation. Where are the highlands? The island of Great Britain is divided into highlands and lowlands along the TZXE line, which runs between Plymouth in the south and Middlesbrough on the east coast. To the southeast of this line lie the flat plains of England, while to the northwest lie the Scottish Highlands. What is the highest navigable lake in the world? Lake Titicaca, located on the border between Peru and Bolivia, is the highest navigable lake in the world, with an elevation of 12,500 feet, 3,810 meters. Though there are higher lakes in the world, Lake Titicaca is the highest one in which boats can sail.
Lake Titicaca was the center of Incan civilization. What is a plaza? Most Latin American cities have an open public square at the center of the downtown called the plaza. The plaza is used for festivals and ceremonies and is surrounded by a cathedral and shopping areas. Which Caribbean country leads the region in tourism? The Dominican Republic is the Caribbean country most visited by tourists. Attracting one and a half million people annually. The beautiful beaches, clear seas. And tropical climate lure tourists from around the world, but especially from Europe. Jamaica is the second most visited Caribbean country, with 850,000 tourists annually. What are the core de loss of Colombia? In Colombia, the Andes are split into three separate mountain ranges. They are the Cordilla Occidental, Western Range, the Cordilla Central, Central Range, and the Cordilla Oriental, Eastern Range. The city of Cali is located in the valley between the Occidental and Central Ranges. While Bogota is located between the Central and Oriental. What is the Atacama Desert? One of the world's driest deserts, the Atacama is located in northern Chile. It is completely barren of plant life. The town of Calama, which is located in the Atacama, has never received rain. The Atacama is a source for nitrates and borax. What is the world's largest tropical rainforest? The Amazon forest is the world's largest tropical rainforest. It occupies one-third of Brazil's land area and receives over 80 inches, 200 centimeters, of rain a year. The rainforest loses 15,000 square miles, 38,850 square kilometers of forest each year because of clear-cutting. The Amazon rainforest is home to about 90% of the Earth's animal and plant species and is a major producer of the world's oxygen. What is Hadrian's Wall? Hadrian's Wall was built under the direction of the Roman Emperor Hadrian in 122 c. He located in northern Great Britain, it was intended to keep out the Caledonians of Scotland. Built of mud and stone, the wall stretched nearly 75 miles, 120 kilometers. 
from Solway Firth in the west to the Tyne River in the east, near Newcastle. What was the Berlin Wall? At the end of World War II, Germany was divided into four zones. Each occupied separately by the United States, the United Kingdom, France, and the U. SSR. The city of Berlin, while located entirely within the Soviet-occupied zone, was itself divided into four zones. Soon thereafter, the Soviets stopped cooperating with the other Allied powers. The three zones occupied by the United States, United Kingdom, and France joined together to create West Germany, while the Soviet zone became East Germany. A similar split occurred in the city of Berlin. The city of Berlin held the dichotomy of East versus West, Communist versus Capitalist. Many people who lived in East Berlin could see that those in West Berlin generally had a higher standard of living. It is estimated that over 2 million East Germans fled to the West within Berlin. In August 1961, the Communist government, determined to stop this mass exodus, began to build the Berlin Wall, a wall that physically divided East and West Berlin. On the west side, the wall became the location of spray-painted messages that voiced free opinions. On the east side of the wall lay a deserted area of barbed wire and armed guards called No Man's Land. For decades, the Berlin Wall stood as the physical version of the psychological Iron Curtain that separated east from west. On November 8, 1989, the Berlin Wall came tumbling down. And soon thereafter the era of the Cold War also ended. <laughs>